Hey guys, my name is Miss Judith, and I'm one of the program directors for a company called Open Minds Education. We provide childcare, enrichment programs, and camps for some of our schools around San Diego County. And we also have a preschool too. Because of the way the world is, and we're all stuck at home, we thought it would be a great idea to provide with some activities and resources to continue learning and having fun. Today, I wanted to do that by doing a science project that I found online to show you why washing your hands is super important. You're probably gonna hear that a lot during these days. This is a super easy at-home project to do, and all you need is a bowl of water that's halfway full, some pepper flakes, I'm using black pepper because it's super light and easy to use, and it'll stay on the water, and I tried seasoning and it didn't work that well, and some hand soap, which you probably have a lot at home right now. So, the first thing that you're gonna do is start grinding the pepper onto the water. And you should try to cover as much as you can, and if you're a little one doing this, I would suggest getting a parent to help just in case you make a little bit of a mess. So how do the peppers stay on the water? Well, water actually isn't flat. The surface tension happens, and that's when molecules of the water are pushing against each other, causing it to bubble up and create this sort of hill with two sliding sides, a point and two sliding sides. So when the pepper is grinded on top of the water, it lands somewhere on top, either on the point or on the sides. But because there's nothing pulling it down, it just sticks there. So for the sake of this project, we're going to pretend that these pepper flakes are actually germs. And what happens if you put your finger, a very clean finger, into a bowl of germs? Well, you get germs all over your hands. Now, what does every mother, teacher, anybody really tell you to do when your hands are dirty. Wash your hands with soap for at least 20 seconds. So, I'm going to take my hand soap and I'm going to put some on my finger and try to get it not to drip. That way it might sort of, oh, so it doesn't ruin the experiment. And I'm going to put the soap to the water and look at that. The germs are actually running away from each other, or in this case, pepper flakes. Now, why do the pepper flakes run away from each other? Well, as I said before, the water has a bubble caused from surface tension with the molecules pushing against each other. And because soap is actually slippery, it causes the pepper to slide down the bubble of the water and go to the sides of the bowl. But what does that have to do with washing your hands? Try rubbing your hands together. Are they getting warm? That's called friction. Similar to the way that we use so to get the pepper to slide off the water, when you wash your hands, friction happens, causing bubbles to occur, which get stuck to germs, pick them up, and then slide off when you wash your hands. Here are some ways that I came up with to use your imagination to make hand washing more fun. Now, think of four things. Jellyfish, riding a motorcycle, singing in a choir, and drawing a tornado in your hands. You're gonna make sure that you're rubbing your hands really tough, using that friction and get those bubbles going. The first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna create your jellyfish pose. Make sure that you're getting right in between your fingers, wiggle them, create that jellyfish, do the other one, make that jellyfish have a friend. Now the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your finger on your thumb and you're gonna ride a motorcycle. Where are you going? Where's one place you wanna go? when you get out of your house. Now do the other one. The next one is you're gonna make sure to put cup your hands together like you're singing in a choir and rub them side to side. And sing five seconds of your favorite song. Um, Akuna Matata, what a wonderful phrase. And the last one, you're gonna take your fingers and you're gonna draw a tornado in the palm of your hand. This is to get your nails really, really clean. Just like that. Now, you're just going to wash your hands off with water. And dry them. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to visit our website at www.openmindslearnbest.com. See you soon!